Police personnel who dressed up in their ceremonial wear marched into the parade ground and took their positions. Grand Chief Sir Michael Somare was escorted into the parade ground and was given the general salute. Parade host and police commissioner Gary Barkey later invited the Grand Chief to inspect the parade. Unlike reviewing offices of normal parades, the Grand Chief Sir Michael was driven through the parade as a sign of inspection. Following the inspection, the officers marched past the Grand Chief in slow and fast motions. In his address, Police Commissioner Gary Barkey thanked Sir Michael for his contribution in obtaining independence for Papua New Guinea. Baki said the parade was hosted to recognize and acknowledge Sir Michael's contribution in leading Papua New Guinea since independence. You are a very special man in our life and history, and we feel that at least this is the least we can do. You have set standards. As a leader, you have sold both on personal and professional level. Integrity, you are a man of integrity. Humility, you are, your feet are still uh, firm. In response, Sir Michael described the parade as a wonderful way of farewelling him from his political duties. Sir Michael, who was the son of a police officer, also encouraged those who participated in the parade to take pride in their duties. To every policeman and the women in this country, I urge you to take pride in your work, which is done with real conviction, a real service to the community. I want to remind you that my father, Ludwig Sana, was a policeman. He was a policeman for a, a long while. And as a, as a son of growing up, I'm very proud, I'm very proud of him as being a policeman. The parade was witnessed by hundreds who turned up at the Bomanopolis College. At the close of the parade, Sam Michael was driven out on the vehicle decorated with PNG flags. Thekla Gunga, National MTV News.